Now I'm moving on with part D of this problem. So again, I was describing something about a, a simple pendulum. I found the angular frequency, the period, and the frequency. And now I'm asking how many oscillations will the pendulum have in one minute? Well, one way to calculate this is to go back to what our definition of frequency really means. It, it's the cycles per time. So I could rearrange that equation to say that the cycles is equal to the frequency times the time, multiplied by the time. So if I take my frequencies, my 0 0.57 hertz, which again is sort of a one per second, and my time, now this one minute, I want to express that in seconds, so it's 60 seconds. When I multiply those out, I'm going to see that I've got 34.2 cycles. Now in some problems you might be asked how many complete cycles are there? Well I only got through 34 complete ones and then part way into the next cycle. So this is an example of doing a pendulum problem. 